Okay, part two, reassembly of the kingpins for the 1930 Model A. Got my kingpins back in now with new bushings by a professional. That was done locally. Uh, we're all set to go now. Let's uh, put them back in. All right, the first thing I want to do is clean out the kingpin hole. Uh, all kinds of old debris in there, old uh, grease. Uh, so let me get that cleaned out so the kingpin can slide in properly. Okay, I have put the spindle on. I uh, put the kingpin in, put the little dust cover in there. Uh, of course, put the new bearing in. Uh, I also twisted this a little bit because the pin is not in to hold the kingpin in. So I was able to attach the brake uh, arm assembly here. So that's inside. Of course, I had to tighten up this bolt over here, or yeah, nut actually, uh, to secure that. So uh, let me hold this and then move it back and forth so it moves freely now within here. This is connected. Uh, this is connected. Of course, I can't put the pin in yet uh, until I had this arm in place because I had to twist it here. So. Uh, now on to the next step okay i was able to reconnect the tie rod ends on both ends this is coming off the steering arm of course got that on uh, and reconnected the brake arm as well so uh, on to the next okay i have the becking plate on now wrestled that back into place put the pin back in and I've put all the bolts in as well. Let me look over here. Yeah, all of these bolts are all tight now. They have the cotter pins on the other side. Everything is connected all the way around. So now the uh, bearings, wheel bearings, and uh, put the wheel back on. Okay, success. There we go. It's all put back together. New cotter pins, new kingpin, uh, new bushings. Uh, all set to go, lubricated, ready to go on this side. Okay, now on to the passenger side. I have the spindle on, of course. The kingpin is in. Of course, the bearing that goes with it. Uh, I also have the lock, lock pin in here over on this side, too, to hold it in. Uh, reconnected the brake assembly here, the brake arm, and put that back together. Uh, now we'll connect this uh, tie rod end back on. Yeah, I do that now before I get the backing plate on. A lot easier to uh, work without that in the way. All right, I put the brake assembly back together on the backing plate. Did all of that before. Uh, lubricated everything in here. Um, put the springs back in, so we should be good to go there. And uh, now to put it back on here. Okay, I have the backing plate on. I want to just point out how I got that pin lined up. So the pin goes all the way from here all the way through the uh, kingpin all the way up to the top mechanism back here so um, anyway just want to show that see how that went back together okay back in plate uh, complete ready for the uh, wheel get that on let's see how that goes okay mission completed got the kingpin in got everything done there over here and yeah, you can barely see it but it's all done ready for action 